Hey everyone, Scott Cobranson from Sports Not. Who's dominating and who's dropping? We're diving into week five's NFL power rankings. And trust me, there are some surprise entries. Let's roll. Coming in at number five, we have the Houston Texans. CJ Stroud is showing everyone why he was a top draft pick. Down 20 to 17 in the fourth, he led a nine play, 69 yard drive to seal the win with a game winning TD. Houston's not just a powerhouse just yet, but in a season where anything can happen, they're proving they can hang with the big boys. Number four is the Detroit Lions. With or without their star center, Frank Ragnow, Detroit's been a nightmare for opposing defenses. Their matchup against the Seahawks is a perfect test. High pressure from the defense, plus a solid run defense. Can Detroit handle it? We'll find out. But right now, they're roaring into the top five. At number three, it's the Baltimore Ravens. They dominated Josh Allen and the Buffalo Bills in their best performance of the season on Sunday night. Yes, Lamar Jackson was, well, Lamar Jackson but Derrick Henry was a bulldozer. He became the only running back in NFL history to rush for more than 200 yards seven times. Okay, he's 199, but we'll give it to him evermore. Next up at two, it's the Kansas City Chiefs and Mahomes and company are survivors, but the injury list is piling up. No Pacheco, no Marquis Brown, and potentially no Rasheed Rice. This team might be limping through games, but with Mahomes under center, there's still a threat to win every single Sunday. And finally, the number one team this week, the Minnesota Vikings, Skull Vike. Three straight wins against top tier competition and they're making it look easy. Sam Donald is lighting up the field. The defense is shutting down opponents. And with Kevin O'Connell calling the shots, this team is looking unstoppable. They're officially the team to beat in the NFL. That wraps up our top five NFL teams for week five. Got a different take? Drop your thoughts in the comments and we'll see who's got it right. Until next week, enjoy.